Hey everyone, I'm Almar of AlmarsGuides.com and in this video here I'm going to show you where and how to get the Scourge Artifact in Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind. So this is a, uh, a weapon that you get from the town slash dungeon, I guess, of Tell Fear. Uh, you're actually going to be coming to this place during the main story. So uh, to get started, we are in the town of Balmora, which is a nice little neutral starting location. And from here, we're going to want to go to Sadrith Mora slash Wolverine Hall. So in order to get there, we're going to go into the Balmora Guild of Mages, and we're going to speak with the Mage Guild guide down here to transport to Sadrith Mora. So uh, Telfir is basically a little bit to the east slash south of Wolverine Hall and Sadrith Mora. And like I said before, you'll be coming here during the main story a few times, actually. But the main one is while you're on the quest to get the cure for the corpus disease. And uh, during that time, you're actually going to be passing right by where you get this weapon. Because uh, you get this weapon in the same room where Deviath Fur is, which is the NPC you have to speak with for the main quest. So make sure you don't kill him when you're here. He has a full set of Daedric armor, and he's the only NPC in the game with a full set of Daedric armor. Well, technically, he's missing the head uh, slot of it, but he has everything else. So we have to use Hop Toad to get a little bit. I should say, for those of you who haven't watched any of my other videos before, I like to uh, use two jump spells quite a bit. The first one is called Far Jump. It buffs my jump by 100 points for three seconds. Basically, lets me do what you see me do at the start of the video. Uh, jump very very far and then I also have hop toad which buffs my jump for a lot less but it allows me to uh, cover smaller ground hills mountains stuff like that just to get over them instead of you know fast travel so where I am on the map right now is where you'll find tell fear you can see the entrance right here and uh, it it's pretty easy to locate there's this bridge that leads up to it and it looks you know residential in this area there's also a boat right there and stuff so it's it's slightly hard to miss so inside uh, Tell Fear, what you want to do is go up into the Hall of Fear, which is all the way up here. And I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. It's probably like Fur or something like that. But And once in the Hall of Fur, you're going to want to go uh, up. So up this hole, I mean. So we'll cast Levitate and fly up here. And basically right in front of us, well, usually depending on what way we face, we'll find Deviath nice. Fur, which is right here. So, uh, there's a few items in this room that are worth mentioning, or in this area that are worth mentioning. In this small ornate lockbox right here, you can find this amulet, which will give you, uh, the Daedric Crescent weapon. If you use it, it'll teleport you to a dungeon, you have to kill a boss, and then come back and you get the Daedric Crescent weapon. In this chest right here, you'll find the Scourge artifact, which is the one that I'm creating this video about. And it is worth mentioning, when you take items out of the chest right in front of him, he doesn't care. Uh, or out of these specifically locked chests. If you're skilled enough to open these uh, chests and take the items, then he basically says they're yours. Also, in this dresser right here, if you open this, you'll find the Curse of Savior's Hide, which is the best light armor chest piece in the entire game. So it, there's a bunch of goodies up here is basically what I'm getting at. But it's this chest right here in front of Deviath Fear where uh, you'll find the Scourge weapon. And that is all there is to it. Hopefully this video helped you guys out. Hopefully it answered some of your questions. And if I forgot anything out, for, forgot anything, got anything wrong, or left anything out, please leave uh, a comment below. That way everybody gets all the information they need, and that way I can, you know, remedy my mistake. Aside from that, though, if uh, this video did help you out, please leave me a like because that helps me out. And I will catch you guys around in future Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind videos. Peace.